All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to Mass Effect. <laughs> um, last time, for unknown reasons, my game kept crashing. Uh, so I basically, what I, I'm gonna try to play it one last time and see if I can get it to work. Uh, essentially, the last time it just kept crashing. So as, what I did is I removed the mod uh, for the uh, graphics, which I think is what was <coughs> causing the issue. Apologies for that. Um, so I'm hoping uh, that re deleting the uh, folder after uninstalling the game and deleting the uh, Bioware folder and the uh, Documents folder will clear this up. Um, if not, then I guess I'll just be hopping off to Mass Effect 2 like I said I would in my last continued Mission 1 video. But I figured I can't just give up that easy. Let me try it one more time. And if it crashes again at some point, Mass Effect it is then. Well, Mass Effect 2, not Mass Effect this. Mass Effect 2. Correction. <laughs> Sorry about that. So let's go ahead and kickstart this. See if, uh, no save quarters. Probably this one. So let's go ahead and load this. That film grain is a little too much for me. Give me a second here. I mean, what? Did I not? Much better. Timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Ha ha ha. sizes and everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing is on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. 
Sarah's a threat to every human colony out there. If they don't stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. <laughs> so as you can see, the graphics is like really shittier in this. Um, I mean, it's nice for a game from 2007. I, I personally like it. Like, it's nice. Um, but, you know, it's not perfect. And why are we allowed to use guns in here? Like, what is this? If you guys will just give me one second, I just want to try to change something here. Um, one second. Uh, we'll do this. Uh, there's something wrong with OBS right now. Just give me a second there. Yeah, so you can see my background is the Normandy. Yeah. Okay, now you're going to act fine. That's weird. Uh. I like having my desktop organized. These are all the games I just like. Okay, so basically, these games are the games I just bought. So these ones are the games I'm testing to see if they work on my computer. So, uh, yeah. What was I doing here? I was trying to change this because it wasn't fitting my screen properly for OBS. So you guys might have been missing a little there. Let's see if it fixes. Oh, you little poop. But as soon as I go into that, it fixes it. Of course. Let me go edit this. And I believe I'm also recording in extremely high quality right now. Ugh. That's going to be hard on storage later. Da -da 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 -da. Fix this. Video output is currently active. Please turn off any outputs to change video settings. Why are you rude to me? All right, screw it. Because my OBS uh, screen is like messed up for some reason, so I don't know if I can just do this. Is this gonna work? Is this gonna work? Or is it gonna do something else? No, of course it's gonna bring me back to that. All right, well. So be it then. Let us be off. Uh, wait, where am I going here? I mean, do I have to go this way? Is this really the way? To a presidium. They probably will. I mean, I know you don't like him, but come on, bro. I just don't get one thing. Why is the blue circle aiming over her boob area? Is that just, like, hovering around the center of them? Or, like, you'd think it'd be, like, around their face or something? I don't know. It's weird. Hey, right, where are we going? Look at that bug thing over there. What's it 
doing? Please do not disturb the keepers. I mean, fine. I won't then. Where do you want us to go? I mean, you're aiming this way. of expanded human colonization insists that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Are we here yet? I mean, this thing's telling me to go in there, and this thing, like, this makes no sense. Like, where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to stay here? I mean... Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council? Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find any hard evidence. I think the Council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. Up, up, up we go. Eh, I'm gonna walk over this place. The hearing's already started. Come on. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson. You always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. He's taught you well. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor, and mine. Saren's hiding behind his position as a Spectre. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned.
It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. I thought you said he was a drunken loser. Couldn't hurt to go talk to him. Just be careful. I wouldn't call him reliable. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the Ambassador's office if you need anything else. Well, that was interesting, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, short-lived gameplay of confusion of trying to find my way around the Citadel. But I'll see you guys on uh, Mission 3, if you could consider this Mission 2 at all. Hope you guys enjoyed.